Hi friends, so in this vlog we are doing little decor, we are decorating. I've just been in the mood to like really just sit down and actually like plan and decorate my place because the thing about me like I get overstimulated so quickly so it's like if I'm not like focused enough like I will just neglect like what I want to do. So like I've been decorating my place since I had it for a year now. Every like couple of months or so where I'll get like inspiration and I'll like implement it but lately I'm like you know what it's been almost like a year anniversary of like me buying my place so I'm like you know what I got to like really sit down and incorporate what I've been like wanting to add to my place. For the most part everything what I need is here just about like adding those finishing touches to my place like more artwork just making the place feel like more homey and more lived in so that's what this vlog is gonna be about right now it is currently Saturday so I'll show you guys what I kind of want to like do I just have my dining room table and then I have like some artwork but that's pretty much it like this whole wall is is like plain and then this corner as well is plain so I think I definitely want to like spruce it up a little bit so that's what we're doing. So I actually ordered like a bunch of different things from like Etsy, Amazon, I think those two so far. But yeah, so what I wanna do is at like a bar cart here in this corner and then at like a print to go right above it. And then for this wall, I wanted to add like three long floating shelves and then add a bunch of like of my favorite knickknacks like books, some candles, plants, all that stuff. So that'll be in this corner. And then we have this corner over here. But over here is like just plain, but I wanna add like a little like bean bag reading chair over here. And it just came in the mail, so I'm like so excited. But um yeah, so like a little bean bag here because I feel like every morning I do like my journaling, my devotional, my meditation, all that stuff here. So I feel like having like a designated place, just even a place for like me like to play like my switch sometimes or just like just like a little like cozy section I wanted to incorporate so I'm going to be unboxing the chair suit me because it is here so so excited and then I also bought I also like ordered a bunch of different prints as well too and frames for those prints but they won't come in until like until the end of this week so fingers crossed that it actually comes in on time but um yeah here is all the packages over here here is the chair and then I have like just packages over in this section over here just to make extra things. I think the first thing I want to do is do the beanbag chair. Let's go ahead and box it! like a little pillow back here so now I'm concerned that I don't know if this will fit in that little like corner that I was showing you guys earlier but we're gonna see because if it can't fit there I have no idea where I'm gonna put her so let's see that What do you guys think? I kind of like her. I don't know. It's kind of dark, so it's like hard to like really envision it when it's like brighter in the day. But I don't know. She's like comfy. I definitely have to get like used to it because this used to be empty. Like this part used to be empty before. But I think with like my couch and everything, I think it blends well. I think as well after like a couple of days, like it will like fully be fluffed out because it is still brand new. So it's like not its like fullest potential I would say but for now I don't know she's cute I like her it's like I'm so excited to just like read and like have like my tea set up right here obviously with a coaster and just be able to like just sit down here every morning and I'm so excited I could also eventually like add books like down here in this area or I can even build like a little mini shelf here um I don't know but having this be like my designated like reading nook area I think it's so cute okay next I want to set up my bar cart so I'm gonna go ahead and open that now Hopefully it isn't too complicated to put together. This is also from Amazon as well. Okay. Hey guys, today is Sunday. I did not end up doing the bar cart. I did not end up doing the bar cart, but I'm gonna try to do it today. Also the shelf, hopefully. So we're just gonna hopefully get this set up today. And we're gonna go to Lowe's as well to pick up, to look for some shelves to see what I could potentially put in my dining room area. And then 
The shells that I do have, I think, are in this package here. Okay, so I got these white floating shelves. I was gonna put like on my office area, and then I think I might. There's like five in here total, but I think I'm gonna use three here and then put two in my bedroom. My bar cards. I'm gonna push it to the area I want it in. Currently at Lowe's. I also want to get like a plant as well from Lowe's. Put on my shelves. Like a small like cat friendly plant. But we'll see what I find. Hey guys, it's the next day. I have a couple of things I want to get done today. My other shelves from my dining room finally came in. So hopefully I'll get help later on today with putting those up. And I'll show you guys what we did yesterday. So we got these three shelves up. I'm still playing around with adding different things onto the shelves. So this is not complete, but the shelves are done. And then I think I'm gonna take some of the things from this area and add them here because I bought this like container and I'll show you guys in a second for like my craft stuff, which I have in my closet. So I think I'll put my art and crafts things like my painting supplies down here maybe. And then add some of my things here, up here. But um. Yeah, we have that, and then we also have the same um, shelves in my bedroom. So we have one here and one there. And again, I'm still playing around with what I want to add up here as well too. If I want to add like a candle or I'm not sure, but okay. So this just came in. It's for my like art supplies. I already have storage for my painting stuff, but I think I, think I like this one better because it's like clear and I don't think I'll be able to buy more like painting stuff or whatever the craft stuff and put them in here as well too. So I'm gonna unbox this and move some things around and then I also got this blanket that I ordered and I didn't order it for like for decorating purposes I only ordered it because I just wanted a, a big blanket but I'm curious to see if I can actually like put this blanket somewhere and if it'll look nice or not but um, I got this blanket again from Amazon and it's like this king sized blanket and it's like forest green color. So this is a blanket, it's really big. I'm curious to see if it can fit like on my my bean bag that I showed you guys in the beginning of this video, like my reading nook area to see if this will like look well. If not, no big deal. Like I said, I didn't really buy this for the tension of decorating, but it'll be nice to play around and see like where this could potentially go as well. Okay, so all my paint stuff is currently in here. So I have two extra canvases that I had for my Galantis party. And then I have like my paints, brushes just like in here. So I'm gonna try to organize it some more and put it into my new storage bin. So I'm not really sure about it for now. I think it kind of darkens up my room a little bit. My living room, I'm not sure. Let me know in the comments, but I'll leave it here for now just so I can have like a blanket whenever I'm like to get cozy in the couch. But I don't think it's gonna be like a staple decor piece for this space, but yeah. So I completely forgot that I got this thing for my job like last week. It's like the thing you like mix up to put like letters on. So it's like this and then you put letters on here. So I think I might move my things around and like for my office and put some letters here. I think I'll put like my vision board quote of the year, which is um, fortune favors a bold. So I think I'm going to hit the letters. So I'm gonna fill that out and then it also lights up. I think it's battery charged, but yeah, I'm gonna play with this a little bit and see where I could potentially put this as well.
Hey guys, don't remember where we left off, but I have a couple of prints that I wanted to show you guys that I got from Staples. These prints, one of them is going in my kitchen and the other one is going in my living room area. I'll show you guys that shortly. But this print is like from a photo shoot that I did maybe two months ago. Let's open her up. So I actually got this print from Canva first and then I had them send it to my Staples, my local Staples. So that's the Canva card. And here's the print from the photo shoot that I did. So I already have the frames of these as well that I got from Amazon. It's the 12 by 16 print. So I'm going to frame this one. And I also got this print which I got from Etsy. This is going to go in my kitchen area. This one is it's like the fruit of the spirit. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and frame these two and then I'm going to put them on my wall. Okay, here are the prints. Oh, I can't see because of the glare. And then here is the other one. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and hang these two frames up. I don't know if I ever showed you guys this section, but this section is right behind my couch where I have my record player, all my records, I'm just little knickknacks. I have this print that I put on this wall not too long ago, but it's from a photo shoot that me and my cousin did and my friend when we were in Colombia. And then I have this wall of like Polaroid. So I'm like, it feels awkward to just have two picture frames and this is just like artwork, if that makes sense. So I'm gonna have the picture of myself here and I'll put this somewhere in my entry doorway and then I'm gonna add the kitchen prints like right here. So let's do that. I don't know if I showed you guys, but um, the office is done. So we had the shelves hanged up and this used to like light up, but it just died for some reason. But normally this would be like lit. And then I think I'm gonna get like a laptop stand to make this higher to kind of like get rid of that open space right there. But yeah. And then I have on my crafts things over here, I have my paintbrush and other things. I have a few canvases in here and like my paints. And the office looks a lot more put together and I'm really liking it. And then also we did put up the shelves over here. And I put like one thing on it so far. It's this um, tile that I got from Mexico City for the wedding I went to. But yeah, so I have these shelves put up and then we also did, um, I added this plant here and then a picture of me from when I was like three years old. This is your sign to put a picture of yourself when you were a kid somewhere and like near a site. So that way like whenever you feel like you wanna talk bad about yourself or like just you're being really hard on yourself, remember that you're talking to that version of yourself. So having this picture like close to me in my bedroom is really helpful to like remind myself to like just be kinder to myself. But um, yeah, that's on that shelf. And then on this shelf, we have these plants here. Yeah, that's pretty much it for my room. The last thing that I have to do is pretty much fill up these shelves over here. I think I'm gonna go to the thrift store this weekend and buy some like books and just like knickknacks to put here. And then I'm still waiting on two more prints that I've ordered that are supposed to come this Sunday, fingers crossed. But one print is going to go over this bar cart and then another print will just be somewhere in this section or I'll find somewhere to put it, but um, that is the current update. Hey guys, it's the next day. I just came back from two different thrift stores to buy some so knickknacks for the shelves that I have over here. So I'm gonna show you guys that now. I went to Goodwill. I got all these books from Goodwill and they were like 99 cents. Like they were really, really cheap. It's in these books that I actually wanted to read. Like I think Life of Pi I wanted to read. Um, then it's like this Misty Copeland dance book which I thought was interesting. And anyway, yeah, I got some books. I got this cute, I'm not sure that it's supposed to be like a book decor type of thing. I think it is, but I thought it was really, really cute. So um and this as well. I also got, this is not really into home decor, but this is so cute. Like look at this top guys, how cute. But okay. I got this little mini plant, these cute like bowls. Here's this one, so cute. And then I also got this one and it says joy inside. Got these two and I also got this like cute like teapot thing as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and see what kind of fits on this wall and then go from there. Here are my shelves. I can actually add some more things as well too, but I didn't mention to you guys, I actually plan to like start, I actually plan to start a new hobby soon. So I want to create like those book nooks um, that I saw like on TikTok. It's like those little miniature like um, 
world that they put into a book you kind of like display it on shelves so i really want this book is to be like a um book nook as well too so over time once i start creating those i'll definitely fill out those empty spots here but for now i think it's really, really cute like i think it's simple i think the colors blend really well but yeah i think it's really really cute also got the prints that i've been waiting on that i've been saying this whole time in the video it actually came earlier than expected this is the print that i want to put above my bar cart area isn't that so cute it's like a wine bottle i just love the design at this print. Um, I got it from Etsy if anyone's interested, but I just think it's so, so cute. But um, yeah, I already have the frames for both of these designs, but let's open up the other package to see if it's my other print. <gasps> it is my other print! Guys, look how cute this is. This is literally so adorable. So this is the print I was waiting on, so I'm glad that it actually came out on time. I think I'm actually gonna frame this and put it on the shelf as well too. But look how cute! It's a little cat. It's actually Bobo. Look Bobo. It's you! Look Bobo, it's you! But yeah, it's a little cat in a cafe. So cute. So I think it'll be cute like in my on my shelves as well too. But you guys, this is the last part of like my home decor for this week. But um, let's go ahead and frame these and add the last finishing touches. And that is it for this week's video. In this video, we were able to really just create a reading neck area for myself, which I really, really love and my favorite parts of this home decor series. We were able to add a few shelves to my office and to my bedroom to really add more little intricate like knickknacks and home decor things to really brighten up the space. We were able to completely transform my dining room area and add really fun colorful prints and just little knickknacks to give this place more personality and character. We were able to just add like the finishing touches that I've always wanted to add for the longest. So I'm really, really grateful that I had the chance to do that this week. I don't take anything um, for granted. I'm just really grateful um, that I get to just like be in my own space and design it the way I want to and decorate it the way that I want it to. And it's just been really fun. It's really fun. Um, I feel like I'm surrounded by like so many different parts of me, so many like expressions of myself and just overall like it's just i just feel like i'm surrounded by like all my favorite things so i'm really really happy if you like videos like this one make sure you guys leave this video a thumbs up and comment down below your favorite part of this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys for another video next week bye